It, it's on Balls Deep's channel. I think she's working on getting it uploaded to YouTube as well. Mm -hmm. Hard counter pick coming out of Bane Links right here. I think this is also one of the worst matchups in the game if you can get started as Arbiter. I think you could Arbiter bully does Hollow as well this position, Yeah, yeah. But Arbiter... I do think it, Insight's playstyle does not go against Hollow very well. But we'll see how it goes. Yeah, Arbiter has a lot of really good tools though in this matchup. Like Overshield for the minions, Up Gun if uh, he's trying to jump at uh, far screen positions and stuff like that. Uh huh. Just, just a lot of stuff that directly counters uh, Gargos. Mm hmm. He the, does not. Minion, I don't yeah, think he really has an everything. answer for uh, blocking Reckoning though, which is pretty important. He sort of does. His best answer is he can, if he reacts fast enough, you can use the the shadow command grab, actually. But it costs meter, right? The first block reckoning? What? The, like, if he blocks the first reckoning before he... No, no, no. You make you make heavy reckoning with, with shadow command grab, and you punish it with the uh, command throw. No, I was talking about if they're, like, flying in the sky, they do, like, medium reckoning bounce off you. Oh, you just jump and do medium punch with Arbiter. Oh, yeah, I that's think it's, another, like, guaranteed. That's another good thing Zero is talking about. It's right there, mainly could have Shadow Command throw right there. Yeah, having gun against Stone Skin is pretty good just because he can't block, but Chroma, of course, being pretty good and only popping it up close, so he doesn't have an option, the uh, the time to do such a thing. Also, Arbiter yeah, does not just have got... fast heavies. Nope. That was a very good sequence there from Chroma. Ooh, that was probably punishable on hit. <laughs> the medium kick into grenade. Yeah, those are so hard to react to though, unless you're really like. If you're looking for, for them, yeah. And like when I get hit, I'm expecting a combo, not like a reset. So I'm never ready for that stuff. If you can slow down the game, like get your overshield, put a grenade on him, air to air him with jump medium punch, it's all really good. There we go, catch some jump. Plus out. frames, plus frames, overhead. Yeah, I like how uh, Arbiter's Instinct just kind of invalidates like several other instincts just because of uh, its projectile blocking ability. Mm hmm. Damn, he's catching uh, do you want to see more? Back. Sorry, you go ahead. I was going to say, I want to see more jump medium punch from Bane Links for sure in this matchup. That's an easy hiccup for but he didn't drop it. Yeah, our, uh, Bane Links has been awfully stuck to the ground. Oh, he missed time the frame trap. Grab through the grenade. That's the one weakness of grenade as a resource or as a reversal. You can grab him out of it. <laughs> Trey, that was so if I'm bailings, I'm popping instinct as soon as possible. Like, why not? You you pop your instinct, get your shield, then you'll build more instinct. Yeah. Yeah, that's something I definitely see a lot of Arbiter players do. Uh, that at least the Arbiter players begin around here doing is they just like kind of wait for a, a moment to pop their instinct but i feel like it's so good just have the overshield recharge and whatnot yeah. especially like, where like, you can easily like it's not uncommon for arbiter to get three instincts a game yeah if you if you really pop overshield a lot as often as you can and use your instinct as soon as you get it but yeah i think if you block the medium reckoning just jump forward medium punch or neutral jump medium punch and i think it's a pretty good option for arbiter but he's getting grabbed there yeah, I'm assuming if you do something like that, you're forcing the Gargos to probably go for an another immediate Reckoning or something to beat it. If even that's fast enough. I'm not sure what if that's fast enough or whatever. I don't think it is. We're just getting murdered in the corner right now, though. Yeah. Right. Yeah, the Air Fairy looks sick. I wish Kim had one. That'd be cool. <laughs> Arbiter, yeah, this is Air Parry. It's not very useful, I don't think, though. Yeah, at least it's like pretty safe because like you just have landing recovery time most of the time. Game. And I think like you sometimes on defense you have to use your command throw, and Banelings hasn't been doing that, right? It's throw and vol. If you have a read that Gargos is gonna throw you, Argonos and Idol both do pretty good against Gargos. That is true. It's got a tall mountain to climb with this Argonos, though. Mm-hmm. And Agonos does do uh, slightly less damage off of his uh, unbreakables. Mm hmm. Wall crashes. Yeah, just wall crashes in general, too. It's not just the unbreakables. I mean, oh, they, still, 
they still do damage, don't get me wrong, but it's less than it used to be. I would have grabbed that wall and used it as a club. That's a why you're not wall. dogging us, player. I guess. Nice hand here with a flick. Shadow counter is good. But Never mind. The block. It's not. Could have popped enough. instinct, but I don't think Karama realized. Can I get three chunks? Yeah, three chunks. That's a chunky boy. This is Night Slash's child, as he often says. It's an anti air medium. Oh, or command throw, yeah. Either works. Damn. I don't know if you want to be this far away, though. I didn't think about how good light payload would be for catching uh, these these boys, because they have so few frames. Yeah, it recovers very quickly. That went under that? Nice from Karama. Yeah, this uh, is an interesting match, because like Gargos is so tall. or It's interesting for that heavy punch button. Gargos is super tall, but I think if he's crouching, it does miss. Uh-huh. Gargos crouch is pretty low. Oh, we're getting chunky. We got as chunky as can be. Chunk. No, he's keeping all four. He gets a, a combo, combo off that. Oh, yeah. oh, but he dropped the manual. No shadow counter One. from Kurama. Although, definitely with the three chunks, that was probably the wrong choice, actually. Now that I think about it. That was sick. Alright, alright. Moral victory, as Trash says. Yeah, you always want to at least not give them the Supreme. It feels good. Alright, pop your instinct and just chuck breadsticks at him. Why not? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, especially if he's doing this shit. Oh my god, he kept inputting. He didn't wait for it. Yeah. He's probably already committed to the action. Except... You also gain your health back on Yeah, it's got Bloodborne thing. mechanics too. It's got the rallying system. Tekken 8's a really. Uh, they put a lot of interesting new systems in there. I like it. Oh my god, we're just getting mixed in the, uh, the new corner here. Yeah, Agnes no has really good strike throw. He just rolls up in its face, block a ball shit going on. Oh <laughs> my god. I think he's got to spend the wall to kill. Never mind. <laughs> You're wrong. <laughs> just did just enough, yeah. <laughs> oh my no god. Let's go do damage. Eating a though. lot of that unscaled damage, though. Oh yeah, MK is like the exception. MK has hella chip damage. It's crazy. Yeah, NRS has. NRS always has chip damage. Yeah, just mash out of that. He's not that plus on that overhead. Honestly, uh, NRS chip damage is a little bit unhinged for my taste. Hey, it makes us you don't need mix, though, to win. You can just kill with a bunch of mids. Okay, here we go, getting tossed. Honestly, for how dominant it started, uh, Karama's doing pretty well. That was safe. I would throw that for uh, No, we're chunking. Actually, no. Argonos' A is like a slower A, I think. Yeah, he can't roll. He did get the minion, though. It's probably worth I'm doing much better this game, though. Okay. This could potentially be the last round for MLG 420 Blaze at 360-69, though. True. He's got to be able to get that resource, and he's got to... I wonder if you can, like, react to the startup of, like, a not-light portal punch with shadow punch. Uh, maybe if the boys weren't in the way. We got him! Oh, but he dropped it! No shadow counter! Gets throw punished because it's minus five, I think. Ooh, get tossed. Frame trap. Karama's brought this all the way back. Oh, it's time to throw out some punches, though. We got we got instinct. He's not gonna die off this. He still breaks. We are still like a good two wall crashes of, you know... Gets the chunk, though. Very important. Gets thrown! Still alive! I don't like that, even with the breadstick, he didn't try to challenge after blocking that sweep. The oh boy is still God. behind him! Yeah, he, if he gets one confirm here... Yeah... No, that's it. It was in the air. Baraba bringing it back, taking a close game four. Mm -hmm. Take the set. GG's.